The mighty Manawatu district in the Lower North Island is one of the key dairy producing areas in New Zealand, and the Ōrawa River, a major tributary of the Manawatu River, runs right through it. The challenges that the Manawatu River and its tributaries face have been well publicised, but this is a community who have bonded with the river and have faced up to those challenges and are starting to reap the rewards. The purpose of the Catchment Care Group was to bring whole of community together, involving government agencies, local council, iwi and business, all with different interests, but working on a common purpose in terms of improving the water quality of the Aurora River and its surrounding catchments, including its tributaries. It's also the opportunity to be innovative and to be practical about finding solutions that will endure, that will last, that will benefit the community. It's been highly successful and there's been a huge level of what we call community participation, uh, working in partnership together. Kei te ora te wai, kei te ora te tangata, kei te ora te whenua. The land and the water are nourished, the people will survive. We started identifying areas on the farm which were a bit wet in the winter time and they were probably unproductive and um, often they created pugging when you put cattle there. So we decided we'd start fencing them off and in some areas we've started planting. The uh, local land care community group got a couple of the local schools involved and uh, they came along for one morning and helped us plant about 1,300 trees here. Every little bit of small work is done on farms helps the water quality downstream and it'll all help in the big scheme of things. In association with farmers, the Manawatu District Council is working collaboratively through the Orua Catchment Care and other groups that are working in sections on the tributaries that come into the Orua River. This is a network that ultimately will see the whole of the Orua catchment, I believe, planted out, fenced and being able to deal effectively with the uh, effluent that discharges from land. We've put $15 million into the capital upgrade of our fielding wastewater treatment plant. We have purchased $5 million of land adjacent to the river for which we're going to irrigate in a couple of years, round about the summer of 2016 and 17. It's a real priority for us. And local government today, we are tasked really with getting the infrastructure sorted. It's a long commitment. It's over years and years, but we've started. We're making a difference. We meet on a regular basis. We've got an action plan that we've all signed up to. And we are in the process of monitoring our actions to see just how far we've got and what we need to do and to prioritise them. It'd be easy to ignore the challenges associated with improving the Ōrawa. But for the local iwi and the surrounding community, this is a long-term project and one which every part of the community is committed to. It's a journey where the focus has been taken away from blame and channelled into making a difference for the future of the river. Mm -hmm.